kiss Candace and hand can you kiss can you kiss this part. Oh, you burped to my face. That stunk. Gross. Mr. Padfoot and Mooney. Disgusting. Anyway. We are here to unbox our box of shadows. This is actually the second one I've gotten. Um, they sent us a... Where's my tablet? Oh, it's right there in front of my face. They sent us a box um, a few months ago. I think it was the September box. I need to look it up. I'm not prepared on my tablet's about to die, so forgive me. I'm not prepared today. Anyway, they had sent us a review box back in September, and it was absolutely amazing. But I knew I was going to be getting ready to move, so I could not subscribe at the time. And I was so bummed that I had to miss the October box for Samhain, but, you know, it is what it is. Um, so I, I told them definitely I would be subscribing as soon as I got moved. And then when I moved in, the... Um, the January box was already sold out, but I went ahead and I can't remember if it was a three month or six month subscription, but I got my subscription for this started and um, the box comes in three tiers and if this would hurry up, I would tell you all about it. Well, Alright, um, Box of Shadows, which is actually located here in Atlanta, which I love, support, I love supporting local artists, lo local creative types, so that is so awesome. Um, Box of Shadows, for Pagans, by Pagans, uh, Box of Shadows is an affordable monthly subscription box that delivers new age or that delivers basic new age worship worship supplies um, as well as altar decor craft tools and jewelry and surprise items for pagan worship um so you get a choice of three different boxes you can get the initiate um, that starts at 19 19.99 a month plus shipping which includes one bundle of five undressed candles, one box of incense, one smudge stick, um, herb of the month, or gemstone of the month, and up to three surprise worship items. Um, then you got the mid-tier box, which is the priestess, starting at $29.99 a month plus shipping. Um, you get all the stuff above from the initiate box as well as up to four surprise uh, worship items or you can get the supreme which is what I got because um, if you're gonna go for broke you might as well get the best so the supreme box starts at $39.99 um, you get all the stuff above plus up to five surprise worship items and So, yeah, and um, unfortunately, it says the March circle is now closed. The April ordering cycle begins on March 15th. So, um, yeah, so they've already sold out the March box. That's why um, I went ahead and got a, a longer term subscription because their boxes sell out really, really fast. And, um, so this is the February box. So I'm already secure for my March box. And we're all, they're already going to be taking orders in a couple of weeks for the April box. And I cannot wait for that one because that will be my birthday box. So very excited. This is an awesome box.
Um, I just absolutely love my first one. I have already taken a look in here. Um, so I cheated a bit. I'm sorry. But, um, and I got someone at the door. Be right we had a neighbor stop by and visit. So anyway, you open the box and that's what it looks like. Oh no, Pat, Papa wants to go hang out with the neighbor because he likes the dog. Now we're not going anywhere right now, Boo Bear. Mom is busy. So we... We spilled stuff on the floor. Um, it tells you it's candle caution and how to charge your candle. And then this your love box. And little wee care thing. So So this is our spoiler card. So so open up. It smells so good. So this is Sorry. The first thing we have on top is Smellcraft's Mojo Bag. It's called Love Spell. And I guess, I guess that's what smells so good. It's got dried herbs in it. And I'm just going to go ahead through the spoiler card and tell you what everything is. Um, you get one one love mojo bag by Smellcrafts. One love votive candle, which kind of has a cinnamon scent. This is spilling out all over and I don't know what it is. Oh, let's fold the baggie down. Oh, it's spilled out everywhere. So, um, this is, I think, the herb of the month, which is Rose of Jericho. I've never heard of that. It has a nice smell. Then we have our Incense of the Month, which is Mimosa. I love incense. Uh, all this pretty small stuff and all these boxes are driving my nose insane. You get our stone of the month, adventuring. This is what I'm excited about. One Lip Potion by Smellcrafts. Balm for Magically Soft Lips. Shea Butter, Cocoa Butter, Coconut Oil, Beeswax, Vitamin E, Color, Flavor. So we got this Lip Potion Lip Balm. we got our candles 
and then some lovely colors. And this should be our smudge stick, which I might need to smudge today. I have yet to smudge my new house and since I moved in, so I've been meaning to do that. Just, you know how it is. Um, and this one is actually lavender, which is going to smell amazing. So we got an extra item, a tea light candle, because we got it goes in there because we got a lotus oil burner. Just beautiful. Been needing a new one of these. Then we got our last item, which is a, a book called Magical Symbols of Love and Romance um, by Richard Webster. And it is um, from Llewellyn Worldwide Publications. They are one of my favorite New Age um, publishing companies. Um, I am friends with Silver Ravenwolf, um, a very big author in the community. I've known her for over half my life. Um, she belongs, she had belonged to um, part of the bigger group. Um, that I belong to, um, it was Serpent Stone, so, um, I love her books, and she publishes through Llewellyn, I love this company, um, they, they put out really great books, so, and I've got tons of them, so I'm excited to get a Llewellyn book, that's always a plus, um, and Llewellyn books are kind of pricey, yeah, this one's, this one's 13 um, they're, they're kind of pricey, but they're kind of moderate, um, so not too bad. But it's always a plus getting a book. Um, then we go in here, and it um, has a article on, cast, on casting love spells and the caution behind them, as well as breaks down... Um, other items in the box, like the Rose of Jericho, also known as the Resurrection Plant. Um, Rose of Jericho is a rare magical botanical sought after for use in voodoo and Santeria tra traditions for love and money spells. The flower is commonly used in love spells when seeking to bring life, love, well, <sighs> The flower is commonly used in love spells when seeking to bring life to um, love that has died or create love where there was none previously. Place your Rose of Jericho in a bowl of water and after half an hour um, it will start to blossom. Water it every two days. Or water it every day for up to seven days. Then allow to dehydrate completely about two days. The Jericho will close its branches and curl back into a ball. Then you can reuse it again and again. Many families will carefully keep, keep the plant, um, passing it from generation to generation. Um, the dry rose of Jericho should not rot. Keep this herb in a bowl by the front door to bring blessings into a home. The water is changed often and is sprinkled about the home to cleanse it and bring peace. Use the water to cleanse yourself before ritual or spell, spell work. Wash floors and doorways and to, and to anoint candles. Um, hint, place a few sprigs in your mojo bag to re resurrect lost love. I'm sorry, I'm just tired and can't talk today. Um... 
and we've got a mimosa incense and magic mimosa is a plant correspondent to the planet saturn and element of water it's considered a feminine plant it's used in purification spells and rituals mostly when sprinkled around the area powdered or chopped even it is said to confer prophetic dreams when placed below um pillows your pillow also protecting from nightmares and helping pleasant dreams come true mimosa is added to all sorts of love mixtures as a touch of subtle dominance particularly by women so then we got our gym adventuring um green adventuring uh green adventuring is known as the stone of opportunity thought to be the luckiest of all crystals especially manifest milk I'm getting fed up with talking. <sighs> Especially manifesting love, prosperity, wealth, and for increasing favor and competition in competitions. Its winning energy makes it a great ally for boosting uh, one's chances in any situation. This beautiful stone, however, is not merely an, an attractor of luck but one that aligns conditions so the opportunity is in inevitable. Green adventuring releases old patterns, habits, and disappointments so new growth can take place. It brings optimism and a zest for life, allowing one to move forward with confidence and to embrace change. I need that right now, definitely. It enhances one's creativity and motivation, which, that's great because I'm ready to get back into my graphic designing um and encourages perseverance and maneuvering life's obstacles definitely need that it also reinforces one's decisiveness and amplifies amplifies leadership qualities yes no due to limited availability the stone was only included in the february priestess and supreme boxes this month so i got those that's awesome um then we have our lavender sage lavender is an, an excellent meditation herb and is often associated with love spells as well as for workings to bring calmness and peace burning lavender incense during meditation can help you relax open your mind and for yourself dried lavender leaves are great for placing into mojo bags especially those used to attract men using it in conjunction with an amethyst stone during ritual may help you achieve a higher level of innate psychic ability and then i'm not going to read this but on the back it tells you um learn something new make a honey jar uh when you sweeten someone or something towards you you're shaping your intention to be like a, a cube of pure perfumed sugar the most commonly used form of sweetening magic is the honey jar i'm going to tell you how to make it So, that is the uh, February 2017 Supreme Box of Shadows. Um, again, I absolutely love this box. And if um, you're into New Age stuff, as I am, definitely check out this box. Um, they said the March box is already sold out. Um, keep an eye on on it if you want to get this box to try and get the April one they send out at the beginning of the month typically beginning middle of the month I believe um, so um, the March or the April box goes on sale March 15th so you better get over there and keep an eye on them because they do sell out fast um, this is just I, I can't say enough things about this but I love this box it's just absolutely awesome. So definitely check them out. I love this this, this company. So, but that is it for us. A biscuit. Come here. Up. Sit. What do we say? Say be sure to like. Hey, like, comment, subscribe. High five. <laughs> Dog hair. And that's it for us.
be sure to click the, uh, click the little bell in the description box below to get notified when we post new content on our channel. That's it for us. Peace.